Good Friday afternoon, San Antonio. I'm meteorologist Mia Montgomery with this weather authority update. After finding some spotty downpours and a few non severe thunderstorms push across parts of the Alamo City through the lunchtime hour, activity is going to become more isolated into the afternoon with a better chance of tapping into a quick downpour or an isolated storm for those along and south of the I 10 and Highway 90 corridor. Still, if you do find some of this activity out there, know that it will be capable of producing some quick pockets of heavy rain some lightning, some thunder, and perhaps some gusty winds upwards of 30 to 40 miles per hour. After finding a brief break in some of the hot temperatures with this rain that moved through earlier today, I still think we rebound back into the low 90s by late afternoon and into the early evening, especially if some of this cloud cover continues to break up and lead way to more peaks of sunshine. If you're stepping out for any Friday evening plans, that isolated rain chance continues through about sunset, then we'll start to see those thermometers fall into and through the 80s. Looking ahead to the upcoming weekend, more of the same, just rain chances on an isolated basis, more of us than not missing out each day. Highs in the mid to upper 90s, but notice by Sunday evening and even more so into next week, we start to see our weather pattern become slightly more active. A low pressure system looks to move in from the north, approaching the central plains early next week as high pressure works its way farther off to the west. When you combine the energy associated with this disturbance with the thicker moisture in place. Daily rounds of scattered rain are looking possible locally again, especially by Monday evening, Tuesday, Wednesday and into Thursday of next week. It doesn't look to continuously rain at your house each and every day, but these scattered rain chances definitely something that we like to see considering we're nearing the end of July and notice your temperatures as well. If we can find that verify the rain cooled air along with the added cloud cover, high temperatures may struggle to to climb above 90 for a few days next week too. We'll continue to keep you posted on that over the weekend and into early next week. Until then, have a great afternoon.